Welcome Sunset Motors. My name is Frank Gerard. How about a beautiful 2020 Integra Aspire? Floor plan is 44W. It's been such a long time since I've had a nice Class A. They're just so hard to come by right now, but here's one of them. Beautiful full body paint. The paint scheme is called Poppy. Interesting name, but it's very pretty. This unit is like new inside and out. These are probably one of my favorite brand, the Integra. I've had quite a few of them. They're well made, just a nice unit. And this is the pre-pandemic production. So I think you're gonna get better quality unit. I've just noticed that uh, the later model, they've been using cheaper material and the craftsmanship is not the same, so I was very impressed with this one. It's got the 450 Cummings, the Allison transmission, plenty of power, just a great unit. Air suspension, got the beautiful awnings with LED lights. It's got the new body style, so you're gonna have all these fancy lights. It's very pretty. Here's Camille, my wife. She's gonna help us out. Notice how the integrity. Oh, that's lights right. Up. That lights it's up. So pretty. On the back too. In the back lights. also. Yeah, very nice. All right. So we've got. There's a 150 gallon fuel tank on these two, which is very nice. You got dual fuel on both sides. That gives you about a thousand miles worth of range, which is great. Got nice compartments, outlets, got a slide out tray, got lights inside. Got a 40 inch TV outside with a sound bar. Beautiful paint. They use four layers of paint, a clear coat. Just very nice. Been waxed, detailed, sanitized. These are your extra chairs for upstairs. You get some extra tile in case you crack them. So that happens once in a while, but there's some factory ones. There's all your breakers, your main breakers and your cutoff. This is the fresh water tank. You can fill it up by sticking a hose in here or through the water hose on the other side. It holds a hundred gallon of fresh water. Very nice. There's your docking lights. You can turn all these lights on and it shines all around. So when you campground, it helps you out at night. Beautiful 22 and a half aluminum wheels with some Michelin tires. Tag axle for extra stability. There's a 15 gallon def tank. There's your main chassis batteries. Filters. Oop. I guess the engine compartment is just powered. It's a Spartan chassis, K2. It takes a, yeah, just hold the button. There you go. Get a little assistance here. Beautiful back here. As you can see, there's no rust, no mud. Just very clean engine compartment. It's an 8.9 liter, lots of power. You've got an outlet here for your uh, engine heater, you can plug this up, it's a thousand watt, it keeps the engine warm, cold climate. It's got a 15,000 towing package, you can go ahead and close it. And it's got the uh, air hookup for your tow brakes, which is already installed, that's really nice. Beautiful LED lights, again the Integra is lit up up there. Get your mud flap, nice side radiator. That's what you want, lots of airflow. Keep everything nice and cool. I really like this water closet here. Everything's simple. It's got a macerator for the sewage and also the commodes have their own macerator. So you, it's getting chewed up twice. Here you, you can monitor the, the water level. You can turn on your water pump, your lights. Got a filter. 
this water hose is powered. So you just hook up this to the campground water and you're good to go. You don't have to bring your own hose. It's all built in. Another really neat feature. I've used this a few times and I really like it. It's called the Sanicon or Sonicon. Sonicon. And you just hook this up to the sewage and that's it. It's got its own hose. You don't have to worry about connecting and grabbing your hose and messing with it. You just put in, put put that in the sewage from the campground and that's it. Here you've got your 50 amp service. It's on the power reel. You got your 400 D aqua hot water system. It's basically a furnace that runs off the diesel and it makes unlimited hot water. It runs off the diesel and also electric elements. So if you have the campground, you can use the campground's utility to keep it warm, but it, it makes on-demand water. It gives you heat inside through forced air on the floor. And also this one's equipped with the heated tile floor. So it's got some water lines under the floor that heats the floor up. And you can actually keep the whole motor home Oh goodness, how do you get in here? Hmm? Well, he doesn't come with it. The cat's in here. Where? Get him out. Oh. I guess he's already out. Sorry about that. <laughs> yeah, he just sneaked in here. We'll have to make sure you don't stay in. Hmm? So back to the heated floor. It's really nice because you can keep the whole coach warm with no noise from air conditioning in the ceiling or forced air or anything like that. It's just quiet heat and it'll keep the whole coach warm with no problem. He's not in there, is he? I don't know. I'll have to go on the other side. Yeah. See, I didn't see him. Yeah. This is where you would release the, the door. Well, we can open it. That's for the generator. There's lots of shining now. There sure are. Yep. <laughs> this is a 10 kilowatt generator. I think it's got 200 and some hours on it. It's not bad. You'll run the whole coach. It's got an auto gen start too. We can program it where it comes on when the batteries are low or if the climate control is asking for air or things like that. No damage on the windshield. He's out. <laughs> All right. Here we've got the keypad. You can program this to Unlock and lock the doors. Also comes with a keyless remote entry. Did you tell them that it also unlocks the? Oh yeah, the cargo yeah, bays unlock. Yeah, the cargoes. That's awesome too. And you've got LED lights underneath here too. All right, got a little storage compartment here. This thing is beautiful in here. How about this? This is nicer than most people's house. Beautiful. They use high quality leather. No vinyl. And real it's got wood. The wine seat. Oh, that's right. And it's got the yeah. recliner thing. I love that. Yeah. Go up one. Okay. I was going to ask one question. Yeah. That's really nice. I guess we'll come back to the cockpit. As you can see, this is all real cherry wood glazed. Cherry Tuscany is what it's called. Beautiful. This couch is a sofa. It pulls out into a sofa bed. That's right, it makes a sofa bed. Yes, this one makes a sofa bed. This one lays down. Hang on, I was gonna show him the TV. Down. How about this 50 inch TV here? On, on the power tray, you can, you can open it and close it. Put it out of the way. Very nice. So yes, this opens up and there's an air mattress in here, right? In this one? There's a pump in the cabinet. And this one just folds out and makes some kind of a bed. It lays down and makes like a, just a bed kind of. How about this floor? Very pretty. Lots of storage. Everything's carpeted inside for noise and just much luxurious. There's all the books. I do like the fact it's got the manual blind. I mean, the, the power ones are nice until they don't work and it happens. I try to have the manual myself. We have an island here, which is 
space in the kitchen. Yeah. Solid Corian countertop with lights. Beautiful stainless double sink. sink. Backsplash, very nice. I love the pattern on this too. This is not gonna out, get outdated. This is very nice. You can just tell the quality. This is all real wood. These pull out. Yeah, very nice. How about these ceiling lights? Got a huge kitchen area. Mm -hmm. Very nice. This pulls out right here. Oh, you yeah? can put a garbage can here, and when you travel, if you want to put these up, you store them right here. And How about a dishwasher? dishwasher? This is an intricated dishwasher, so it locks, and then you knock three times to unlock it. Isn't that cool? This is your induction cooktop. I like the way they they took the time to build mm -hmm. some to cover it up. Yeah, to protect it. High end wood. I've seen some motorhomes twice this price without this kind of craftsmanship. Very nice. Even the inside, they made it pretty. Look at these hinges. Just well made. So have a really big microwave convection oven. Just very nice. And this table pulls out and you can put two more seats so you can sit four people. All right, how about a residential refrigerator? Whirlpool, doesn't look like it's ever been used. Got an ice, there's an ice maker up there and then there's a freezer in the bottom. So this whole coach is electric, there's no propane, so it's got a big 3000 watt pure sign inverter that runs all these components like the refrigerator. So it's basically running off battery right now. Oh, yeah, beautiful. This here is all the fun stuff. Everything is controllable from up here. I was going to show you on my phone also, but I'm using the phone to record. But there's a phone app with all this on here. So you can walk around the coach and control everything. The lights, even the slide outs. The air conditioning has got three heat pumps. The 15,000 BTU. The front and the rear has aqua hot too. So you can use the hot water to heat up the coach. And it's got heated basement. That's why I forgot to mention that. It's really nice in the wintertime. Keep anything from freezing. And there's your floor heat. I've got it so it won't freeze. So you can do electric or, or diesel or both. And you slide out controls. I really like that because you can walk around with the phone. And this thing is on your phone too. You can control everything. You can be outside, put the slides in, the awning. Very nice. You also have a really nice pantry. Adjustable shelves. Mm -hmm. It's a bath and a half. And this is a solid door. It's not, it's not hollow. Got the porcelain commode with the macerator. Real metal faucets. Nice countertop. And there's accent lights throughout, so at night you can just have the little accent That's right. lights on, and it's really beautiful when you can get and to there's the There's the commode, you just push a button and it flushes. You've got exhaust fan here, you've got one here, and one in the main bedroom. You've got pocket doors. This one is a double door. Yeah. Privacy, again, solid wood. These are so nice. Yep. About a king size memory foam bed. Very comfortable. Just like home. And a ceiling fan. That's a must. It's a must for me. Got a nice TV here. And this pulls out. And you've got a safe. The combination is one, two, three, four right now. You can change that. <laughs> Got a DVD player. Got lots of storage. Yes, and everything is laid up. Mm -hmm. All real wood. It's beautiful, and there's also a little bit of storage under the bed. Correct, storage under the bed. 
but I love the back of this bed if you see it's got the material to match it just everything it makes it look so plush this is one of the aqua hot furnace vents you could get some heat through here it's fairly quiet but again the heated floor is even better if it gets really cold you can have both things running at the same time is it it's whirlpool washer stackable dryer yeah i love the whirlpool washer and dryers they just do a great job cleaning lots of room in here too usually bathrooms are kind of tight no this shower is huge yeah solid stuff and it's pretty like i said this is not going to be outdated a large sink i mean you, you've just got storage everywhere it's crazy and how about that closet this closet is awesome i even have a sheet rack in here it's got light and how about a shoe rack? Of course, got to have a shoe rack. And there's your host for your vacuum. It's got central vac, extra carpet. That square on the floor, that's your access to the engine compartment if you had to have access from the top. Again, same principle in the commode. You push a button, get the max air fan, all control from the wall. nice and you've got a with a full length mirror wow so you can get ready for the night get outlets with usb keep all your toys charged up it is so roomy in here with the super slide on that side it's opens up the floor plan really well Let's go to the cockpit. These seats are very comfortable. It's got the smart wheel with your cruise control and your wiper controls all right here. It's got push start, which is kind of unusual. And if you're a gauge person like I am, this is the last year with the gauges. Now they're going with the digital. I mean, it's pretty, the digital, but I kind of like my analog gauges. So we can start it. No, we don't have the key. <laughs> we didn't bring the key? No, it's not. Yes, well, you need the key. But anyway, that's your air system. Uh, you got your push button transmission. It's really easy to drive. You push drive, re re neutral, reverse, air brake. It's got a nice camera system. You can do, when you put your blinker, it's going to do the right camera in the rear. And then you can do normal with the hitch. It looks straight down. You got AM, FM, XM, satellite radio, navigation system. Well, I've used the navigation. I guess it needs to be reboot. Got a JBL sound system. Ice cold dash air. Got nice lit up cup holders. These blinds are electric. So that's your nighttime. And that's your shade for driving. Got a TV up here also. Has some Fuses and breakers, storage. I think we got it. I think so. Even the, the handle lights up, very nice. This is actually better than new. When you buy one that's been used a little bit, the previous owner and myself will 
have enough time to go through and make sure everything's working like it's supposed to because it doesn't matter how new they are there's always little things that's not working or needs attention if you buy a new one you can be stuck at the factory for two three months trying to get all the bugs worked out this one here is already taken care of it's got the, that's why we forgot to mention it's got the direct tv traveler system on top the dish gives you hd tv on your on your tvs you just got to get a receiver this is your first motorhome we'll make sure you're comfortable before you leave go through all the system and make sure you know how to operate everything and i'm also here after the sale you get my number and you can call me if you got questions and i'll try to help you out over the phone to see if this Aspire is still for sale, go to my website, sunsetmotors.com. If it's on the website, it's for sale. If not, you're too late and it's gone. I do have competitive financing available and great warranties also to cover all the components. If you're interested in that, you can give us a call and we can go over those with you. You can fly into Memphis or Nashville. We can pick you up and you can drive home a happy camper. You will not be disappointed. This is a great unit. Make sure that you like our video. And if you're not a current subscriber, just hit the subscribe button. And we sure appreciate all of our listeners. And thank you. And we'll see you again on the next video. All right. Thanks for watching. Come and see us.